right now. God bless. God bless. God bless. All right, Jared. All right, man. All right. All right, Jeff. Mm -hmm. All right. Y'all have a good one, all right? See y'all next Sunday. Be blessed. Be blessed, all right? All right now. on the plane because he was going to testify against him. Right, but I feel like there are better ways to go about it than snakes. Okay, see, this is why I don't like watching movies with you. You're never any fun with it. You don't... Everything you got. Now. God fucking damn it, Dave. Ugh. Son of a bitch. Yeah, no. hey, hey, there you go. There you go. Fuck me running. Oh my god. Fucking my library card was in there. I come here three times a week and I don't even fucking read the Bible. Jesus. So, how's the family? Oh, they're great. Thanks for asking. Got Katie's birthday coming up soon, so, uh, be able to buy her some nice presents now. Yeah, I see that. That's good to hear. Oh, and remember, if you tell anyone about this, I'll fucking kill you. Okay? Yep, I know. Get in the fucking car! <sighs> I hate this fucking town! What, are you not gonna say anything as usual? Well, if you and Dave are such good friends, why don't you go live with him? Dave's not a bad guy, man. Oh, yeah. Well, that's the second time he's robbed us this month. He's got kids, I can't blame him. Well, make sure you say goodbye to Dave because after we're done with the church, we are out of this fucking town. And that's when I fully decided to hand my life over to God. And I can tell you since then, I haven't looked back. Remember you all, it's a journey. Just make sure you walk by faith, all right? So I'll see you all again next weekend, same location, same time. I'll probably have more photos for you all too, all right? <laughs> Hope y'all enjoy it. You all be blessed, man. What a fucking douche. He's really not that bad once you get a chance to talk to him. Oh my God, don't let him fool you. Like, he's a total scumbag. It takes one to know one. What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means that you cause a lot of trouble. Me cause trouble? Can you give me one example? I said one example, and you know damn well I didn't start that fire. It was your bad idea that started the fire, as usual. Don't start that shit with me, Max. Hey, fellas. How we doing? Uh, we're fantastic, Todd. How about yourself? I'm doing fine. Thank you for asking. Hey, I just want to thank you all, you know, for helping out here these past few months. You know, it's really great to have extra set of helping hands. Uh, it's a pleasure. It's been our pleasure, Todd. Just getting to serve God in any way possible is always so rewarding. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's good to hear. Hey, fellas, I have someone I want you all to meet.
Stacy, this is Max and Reggie. They've been working with us as acolytes. Yeah, it's so good to finally meet you guys. I've heard all about you. It's really good to meet more people that want to spread the good word. The word we've been trying to spread is donations. I think what Reg is trying to say is that we're going to need more money if we're going to continue to do the Lord's work. Yeah, no, I, I definitely agree. Actually, would you guys want to join me tomorrow night for Compline? It's, it's a night prayer. It's super relaxing. Um, it can deepen your faith, get you closer to God. I'd love to. I actually, um, we're going to be busy tomorrow night. I'm so sorry, but we're not going to be able to make it. Oh, yeah. No, I, I, I get it. I get it. Well, maybe some other time. And then he, and then he wouldn't stop talking shit. So I punched him in the face. And I, I, man, you had to be there. Reggie, I was there, and after you punched him, all of his friends stomped you. Yeah, that bitch needed backup. Hey, check out what I got. How did you get those? I have my ways. <laughs> Yeah, I tell you, God is amazing, isn't he? All the time. Listen, the amount of donations we made is, is, is remarkable. Oh, man. So, what now? Oh, we go. Tomorrow night. Tomorrow. Doesn't that seem kind of soon? No, no, we have to go before they figure out the keys are fucking missing. Tomorrow's our best option. All right. Hey, where are you going? I'm going back to the church. Stacy invited me to a night prayer. Not much praying is gonna be going on. Shut up, Reggie. Hey, those Jesus freaks are all the same, man. Pretty people with fake smiles. I'll keep that in mind. Lord, it is night. The night is for stillness. Let us be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done. What has not been done has not been done. Let it be. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, new joys, new possibilities. In your name we pray. Amen. How do you feel? I, I think I feel more relaxed. That's perfect. Um, that's how you're supposed to feel. Compline is a really good way to end, end the day, get you ready for sleep. Have you talked to uh, Pastor Todd recently? No, not since the coffee hour. Why? He told me that he can't find the church keys. Do you, have you heard it about that? You know anything? Uh, no, no, I haven't. Yeah, he thinks that someone stole them, which is crazy because, I mean, who would steal keys to a church, especially our church? We've done so much good for the community, I mean. Yeah, it has. Um. Can I tell you something personal? Yeah, of course. Okay. Well, I just, I need you to know that I wasn't always like this. When I was younger, um, I was really reckless. And, and um, one night I was with my friends and we were all drinking and I had too much. And I got in my car to drive home. And I got in, I got into a, a, a really, really, really bad crash. And the, the people in the other car got hurt and, and I got hurt and it was really bad. And, and I was in the hospital and, 
and I thought I thought I was gonna die and I I felt so bad it, it was my fault and I knew I needed to change Stacy I'm I'm so sorry I devoted my life to God, and I've never looked back. Oh my gosh, um, I, I totally killed the mood. I'm, I'm so sorry. That was weird. No, Stacy, no. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that with me. You're so strong. It's all thanks to God and this church. Um. This was really great. We should do this again sometime. Um, I'm busy tomorrow night, but are you free anytime? Yeah, yeah, sounds great. Okay, yep. Yeah. Well, see you later. Yeah, we just finished. He doesn't know anything. All right. Are you ready? Uh, hey, Max, uh, what's up? I don't think we should go through with this. What? We're already here. I don't think I can do this, Reg. This is wrong. We're stealing from a fucking church. We're the bad guys here. Bad guys, huh? And everyone who works here is a saint? Feeding people the same lines of bullshit every Sunday just to get a piece of their paycheck. <laughs> They're the ones stealing, Max. You're wrong. This church does good for people. Oh. And how do you know that? Your little girlfriend? What do you think is gonna happen? You're gonna spend the rest of your life serving God with her? Get real, man. No, you get real, Reg. Ever since we've been kids, all you do is get me in trouble. I can't even speak without you talking over me. You don't give a fuck about me. Do you remember Miss Hansen's class in sixth grade? Yeah, why? Well, do you remember what happened? You pissed your pants. <laughs> and do you remember what I did? You pissed your- I pissed my pants too. And you want to know why I did that? Because I saw someone who was just like me. I saw a kid who didn't fit in and needed someone to be there when times got tough. I... <sighs> We're the same, Max. You're my brother. Don't you- don't ever doubt that. I get it, but I don't think I can do this. I know I've put you through a lot of shit over the years, but once this is over, I'll go. This is the last thing, and you will never have to see me again. This is the last one. After this, I'm done. Yes, one last ride! Oh, Thelma and Luis are some other, like, guy version of that! Oh. How do I look? Reggie, chill the fuck out. What's your problem? You're my problem. Dude, there's nobody here. It's the whole fucking point. Get down. Man, I tell you what. I always like this place much better after hours. Mm, I like it when you're here. 
Can we hurry up? We're going to be late for dinner. Yeah, we're going to make it in time. Just let me grab some cash real quick from the back. Okay, did you find your keys? No, I had to cut some more, you know. I'm just afraid someone's going to... Shh. It's going to be okay. Remember I told you I talked to Max yesterday? He didn't know anything. He is so stupid. Everything's going to be fine. You worry way too much. You know why I always worry. Hey! Who is it? God? I told you, he was a fucking douche. They're armed. Wait, wait! She took it! She took it all! Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure, Max! All right, grab what you can. What? We're not leaving here empty handed. Reggie, we need to go. We just added battery to our list of charges. Then I'm not leaving here empty handed. We need to leave before the cops show up. Then just go, Max, because the way I see it, this situation is still very much under control. We need, we need to keep moving. Just stop. Just stop. It's over. We're not gonna get away on foot. Well, well, if we, we keep moving, then Reggie, like... enough. Please. All right, um, you know what I said earlier about, about how you and I were the same? Well, well, I was wrong. You were always better than me. What? Hey, you piece of shit. Hey, 
you fucking got me, all right? Get the fuck down. Fuck. Here. Everything you got. Now. 